This video is for Nova Online Math 161, and today we're reviewing for the final exam. And the topic um, that we're covering in this video is linear function. A company produces and sells custom T-shirts. The company incurs a fixed cost of five hundred dollars for setting up its printing equipment. It costs the company five dollars to produce each T-shirt, including materials and labor. The company sells the t-shirts for $15 each. A. Write a linear cost function representing the cost to the company to produce X t-shirts. So we're not talking about selling it just yet. Because I remember they were selling these t-shirts for $15. But when they are, you know, making these t-shirts, I want to highlight that part, okay? I will highlight all the numbers or clues that are associated with the cost of producing these t-shirts now first of all they need to set up their equipment right so that $500 is the fixed cost we're not going to have to pay $500 every time we print a t-shirt but you still need to pay that in the beginning have that cost in the beginning to set up everything now next notice that it takes $5 to produce each t-shirt right so the more t-shirts you make the more like each t-shirt you print is going to cost you five dollars so let's write that cost function okay so i'll say c of x where c stands for cost and x stands for number of t-shirt looks like this five times x because for each t-shirt we print we have to pay five dollars so imagine making 10 t-shirts we have to do five times 10. but now don't forget there's that fixed cost of five hundred dollars but we're not going to, you know, pay $500 per t-shirt. That's just one-time fee. That's why we're not going to multiply this 500 by x. So that's it for the cost function. Now let's go down to B. B, they want us to write a linear revenue function. All right. So the revenue is, um, I think you guys are, if you are moving up to 261, you will write more uh, cost, revenue, and profit function. But the revenue function is going to be how many you sell. That will be X times the price of this T-shirt. Now, let me take a look. Did they give us a variable for how expensive this T-shirt is? Um, and I, you know what? I'll go ahead and say price of T-shirt. And I think I just saw that right there. Okay, look. So they, the X represent however many t-shirts they're going to sell. They can sell 100, they can sell 1,000. X will be an input variable. But I think they told us how expensive each t-shirt are. When they are selling it, how expensive is this t-shirt? $15 each. So their revenue function will be X times $15. So I'll just write it prettier as r of x equals 15x. Okay, so we got the revenue function right here. We also have the cost function right here. I have a strong feeling they're going to ask us for the profit function next. Or actually not, okay. So they give us, they're asking us for the break even number of t-shirts to be sold so the, to find the break even number okay what we're going to do i'm going to set the revenue equal to cost and see how many x number of t-shirts we need to sell to have equal revenue and cost okay so revenue function was 15x so i'll say 15x right there and the cost function is equal to 5x plus 500. All right, let's solve this linear equation, okay? Subtract 5x from both sides. Minus 5x, minus 5x. Then you're going to get 10x is equal to 500. Right? Because that 5x is gone. Now, divide both sides by 10. How many t-shirts do they have to sell to break even? Let's see. X has to be equal to 50. So they have to sell 50 t-shirts uh, for their cost to equal the revenue. So if they want to make some profit, 
they better sell more than 50 t-shirts, right? So um, they weren't looking for the profit, but when you move up to 261, apply calculus class after this, um, in 261, you guys will be doing a lot of, you know, uh, profit, revenue, and uh, cost function. Uh, but for this problem, we were to set up the cost function revenue function and if you need to find the break even number set those two functions equal to each other and solve for x so they need to sell 50 t-shirts to break even